Is it time to make a decision on digital world acquisition stock? Let's delve into digital world acquisition. Our initial report was released on our website on Tuesday, March 26, 2024, and now we're providing you with a more comprehensive analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on notifications to stay informed about our latest insights. Stay updated on crucial developments that could affect your investments. Improve your trading strategy with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Access free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please remember that this video is for informational purposes only and does not constitute financial advice. Since March 25, 2024, our system has identified Digital World Acquisition as a buy candidate with a score of 1.19. Let's delve into the stock's performance over this period. We will closely monitor this assessment to observe its developments in the upcoming days. On average, there has been a daily return of 0% since it was designated as a buy candidate. The stock is currently positioned in the middle of a strong upward trend, indicating a potential further increase in the near future. Over the next three months, there is a projected 62.33% change, with a possible return ranging from 22.92% to 128.10%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, the trend suggests a 105.22% change, with a potential return between minus 6.61% and 129.1%. This translates to a price range of $46.65 to $114.44 after a year. In our latest update on Digital World Acquisition, the headline reads, Digital World Acquisition Stock Price Remains Unchanged on Tuesday. There were no fluctuations in the price of Digital World Acquisition Stock during the last trading day, Tuesday, March 26, 2024. The stock traded within a range of $49.95, with no significant changes. Over the past two weeks, there has been a 24.28% gain, reflecting some volatility. Looking back over the past 52 weeks, the stock reached a high of $58.69 and a low of $12.40. Currently, it stands at 14.89% below the 52-week high, at $8.74, and 71.46% below the all-time high on October 22, 2021, when it hit $175. Analyst Ratings On Tuesday, September 6, 2022, Bank of America Securities upgraded DWAC to a buy with an initialize action. On the same day, Wolf Research also upgraded DWAC to outperform with an upgrade action. Analysts have assigned a general sell rating to digital world acquisition stock. They consider the P-E ratio as a strong buy and the price to book as strong buy. The return on investment garners a strong sell rating from the analysts. Digital world acquisition stock analysis reveals mixed signals. While buy signals are seen from short and long-term moving averages, a sell signal arises from the relation between the two, indicating caution. Support levels at $42.08 and $43.59 may come into play on corrections. Additionally, a buy signal from the three-month MACD is noted. Negative signals also exist, impacting near-term outlook. A recent sell signal from a pivot top point suggests a potential further decline, with volume indicating a possible turning point. Low volume heightens risk and weakens other technical signals. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, sell signal 2 days ago. Short term moving average, sell signal 4 days ago. Long term moving average, buy signal 3 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, by signal 14 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 4 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 92 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, by signal 85 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more signals.
Let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for digital world acquisition. Digital World Acquisition currently finds support from accumulated volume at $49.69, indicating a potential buying opportunity as an upwards reaction is expected when this support level is tested. The stock typically exhibits controlled movements, resulting in low overall risk. However, it's important to monitor volume levels closely and watch for any signs of low or declining volume. Notably, the stock showed no price movement between its high and low on the last trading day, representing 0% movement. Over the past week, the stock has displayed a daily average volatility of 20.89%. Let's start by examining some essential fundamental data before discussing potential trading levels for digital world acquisition. The price-to-earnings ratio, known as the P-E ratio, is a critical indicator that compares a company's current share price to its per-share earnings. A negative P-E ratio indicates that a company has negative earnings or is operating at a loss. While downturns are common even among established companies, persistently negative P-E ratios could suggest low profitability and potential risks of bankruptcy. Now, let's explore potential day trading levels for digital world acquisition. In an upward trend, the first resistance level for digital world acquisition is at $50.56. If you're not already invested, consider waiting for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For current stockholders, this could be a target for swing trading. On the downside, the first support level for digital world acquisition is at $49.69. If this support level holds, it might present a promising entry point with the expectation of a rebound. The combined average rating for digital world acquisition from multiple analyst sources is sell. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On September 20, 2021, Barclays PLC conducted an insider buy of zero shares. On September 20, 2021, Barclays PLC conducted an insider buy of zero shares of Class A ordinary share, par value $0.0001 per share. On September 20, 2021, Barclays PLC conducted an insider buy of zero shares of Class A ordinary share, par value $0.0001 per share. On September 20, 2021, Barclays PLC conducted an insider buy of 50,000 shares of redeemable warrants. On September 8, 2021, Arc Global Investments 2 LLC conducted an insider sell of 1,650,000 shares of Class B common stock. Based on the 22 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of 0.000. Overall, insiders purchased 18,056,436 shares and sold 13,740,000 shares in the last 22 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $48.08, representing a decrease of 3.74%. This stock exhibits minimal daily fluctuations, translating to lower risk. A sell signal was identified from a pivot top just one day ago. Is digital world acquisition stock a good buy? Based on several short-term signals and a positive overall trend, we believe that the current level presents a buying opportunity with potential for digital world acquisition stock to perform well in the short term. Our analysis shows that the current price is undervalued after considering the volatility and movements from the last trading day. For trading on Wednesday, March 27, we anticipate digital world acquisition to open at $49.95, with an expected increase of $0.0000000. Trading carries a high risk of financial loss. It is recommended to consult a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Please be aware that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your investment actions. Presenting our current analysis of the stock. We invite you to share your opinions in the comments below. What target do you have in mind for this stock? Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content. Wishing you success in your trading endeavors and a wonderful day from all of us at Stock Invest.